As you may have gathered by now, 1988 will not be an ordinary year for our branch. This year is the year that will take our place, the year that we'll receive what I believe is long overdue recognition for providing customer service. In 1988, we'll be number one, leading local polls as the best public service agency in the Seattle area. Working together, we'll change the way the public sees us. And when we do that, we'll be more competitive in the marketplace, more able to retain load and even build load as we need it. Remember, in a competitive market, excellent customer service makes the difference between a successful company and a second stringer. And there's no magic to providing excellent customer service. It's the little things that count. Saying thank you to every customer, having a smile in your voice each time you answer the phone, or going the extra mile when the customer really needs you. It's the little things, day in and day out, that will build a reputation. And as we earn that reputation, we'll get noticed. Business consultants will come to us, asking what is it that makes our customers so loyal. And we'll all come to work feeling a little more proud to be a part of the City Light team. And while you're at work, Randy, myself, and your management team will be working to say thank you a little more often because you're doing a good job and you've been doing a good job. And to let you know how our good work affects our customers, we invited some of them to tell you just how they feel about the services we've provided. And here's what they wanted to say to you. About a year and a half ago, I was invited to be a participant in the Washington Energy Program. During that time, I met with several properties people, and I found out there was a program put on by Seattle City Light. I contacted Seattle City Light and found out that, yes, we did qualify after they conducted a survey in several of our offices. During this time, I had occasion to meet with several people from Seattle City Light and found them to be most efficient and helpful. Uh, not only in terms of what we did with the survey but in our subsequent uh, energy program, but in small things that we could do. Really enjoyed working with them and have a completely different picture about the public sector after uh, meeting with these individuals. It was a pleasant experience. We have two buildings which were under a grant from Seattle City Light for weatherization. We were allowed the opportunity to replace windows, doors, and weatherize the crawl spaces. We were given this grant and went through the contractor selection process, and once that was done, worked very closely with Rick Jacobson and Adele Martz. The real benefit that Rick and Adele provided for us is that throughout the construction process, they made sure that everything and anything that this contractor did was done properly. The contractor at several times thought their window installation was done correctly. Rick and Adele did not think so and made them come back and do it again and do it right. Basically that was a tremendous time saver for us and the reason that is is that we have not had to call back this particular contractor one time to tell them that we are having problems with the method of the installation. Rick and Adele did a fabulous job for us and it saved us a lot of time and is actually the way which we like to conduct our business. People always appreciate it when people are courteous over the phone. It makes a big difference. Uh, it should make a difference in your whole day. When uh, the people came out to do the work on the, on the oven, the more questions I asked, uh, they had answers. Um, they gave us information as to make sure that that problem didn't happen with us again. Um, to be sure if we have a problem to call City Light. They were very helpful to us. Um, Chris did have a problem with a breakfast that she had promised to make for the guests. Yes, I had promised a sour cream walnut coffee cake for Sunday morning and here I was with the oven not working. The parts were um, very difficult to find and, and Kathy on dispatch was just wonderful. 
she said that she would make an effort to try and locate the parts for our ancient oven and they came through Saturday morning up they were with the parts my oven was ready and I was able to bake a coffee cake for our breakfast on Sunday morning uh, City Light has done us done us quite well we have really no complaints and they have been very very uh, aggressive in trying to help us out in our business and, and just in taking care of the place. Uh, they've been really good to us. Mm -hmm. And hooray for Kathy. <laughs> right, hooray for <laughs> Kathy. The only reason that I got a home energy check was out of guilt. Uh, I thought you had to to be a good citizen and I didn't really want to invite those city light people into my home. But they were very nice. We walked through the whole house. They didn't make me feel funny, you know, like I'd failed in some way. I ended up following most of their suggestions. We weatherized. They told me about the, the loan, the conservation loan, and I got double pane windows and now I'm warm and my dog's warm and my plants are warm. And I'm not afraid of the bureaucracy. If I had uh, any troubles again, I'd feel free to call City Light. The consumer of today, regardless of what industry you're in, is aware he wants service. He wants service. And the more we, as suppliers of that, uh, recognize that fact that we have to give service, the better off we all are in the industry. We called up and had them come out to our home to do an en energy audit and they sent out Drury Wood. And, uh, you know, I thought it would be kind of a real quick type of thing, but he spent well over an hour there explaining, you know, how we can save in a bunch of different areas, not just the windows and the ceiling, that type of thing. He did a phenomenal job. Um, but then I was complaining to him about uh, paying so much on our bills. And uh, last November, we had paid $286 in 37 days. And, uh, and that was the month that we had moved into the place. And uh, he looked at that, and he didn't think that was right. And he said, well, you know, I'm going to do a little bit of checking into this. And uh, he's just an auditor, so, you know, I didn't think it would go anywhere. Well, over the course of the next week and a half, uh, he had called us back like three times, said he'd talked to the auditor, had t or uh, the accountant, I guess it is, uh, pushed it through the whole maze of offices that Seattle City Light has. And lo and behold, it came up that uh, we had an $86 credit coming. And he pushed it all the way through. We got the credit on our bill. And I tell you what, it's something else to get a bill from Seattle City Light and show a positive $43, I think, is what it ended up being after we paid for, for uh, what we had owing on there. And, uh, you know, I've since thanked Jury for it because he did not have to do that in the least. His business or his job is just to go out and do the energy audits. And uh, just, you know, that type of customer relationship and going that extra yard is just incredible because it's something that makes him stand out in my mind and, and leaves me with a good feeling about Seattle City Light. <laughs>